Hello guys, kind of a different video today, um, not as formal. I have all of my fall stuff behind me on my bed. We went to Target today. My son is right here beside me, by the way, if you hear him grunting, he's in like a grunting mood lately. We went to Target today, hit the jackpot. I went to Walmart a couple weeks ago, hit the jackpot there too. Um, I have some Amazon stuff I'm gonna share with you guys. We did go to Hobby Lobby, didn't find anything overwhelmingly cute. Lots of cute fall stuff all over the place. Um, so I'm gonna link as much as I can in the description bar below for y'all, but I'll tell you where everything is from. And let's get started on this haul because I have a lot of stuff. All right, so first and foremost, I have shared these with you guys before, but they are so good that I wanna share them again. So I got these when I saw a woman on Instagram, I believe. I think it was Instagram. Um, share that you can actually use these to like hide things in your home that you don't love to look at. So like remotes, um, things on your desk. And so they're like little storage boxes. It comes in a set of three. The large one is awesome. I usually keep this one on my desk, but I'm trying to clean off my desk. I got to go through it today. So that's why I have that one empty right now, but they are all little storage boxes. They're awesome for decor, like I said, hiding things. And just to show you what they look like up like close, they are such good quality. Now I'm all about like faux plants, faux greenery, anything that's not gonna be real because my cats tend to destroy real flowers. Um, so I did get these vases and then the bunny tails off of Amazon. I, these vases come in a three pack and then the bunny tails, it comes in this like huge wrap pack. All you have to do is just put them out in the sun. I think it even says that on the packaging. Just put them out in the sun for a couple hours um, and they will expand a little bit. But I have like three of these on one of our little side tables and I also have them, um, I had one sitting up on the mantle but I'm about to redo it so I pulled this down this little tray is from Amazon and I actually had like something like this in here with a candle um, I need to order all my fall candles I'm gonna go with life and lilac this year since that is Jen Reed's brand versus um, Bath and Body Works because life and lilac they're made like more non-toxic so um, I, I love this and usually I'll like keep a little candle in there and it looks really cute let me grab one to show you so this is usually kind of the situation I have sitting up on the mantle, but I have a shorter one actually that I was using. And then also these tulips. So I had to get two packs to make them look really full. I'll show them to you in a hurricane in a second. I have hydrangeas, like faux hydrangeas all over the house, but I'm gonna be honest, I'm just kind of over them. So that's why I went with the tulip. So I did get two packs of these and they look really good in the hurricanes that I got from Walmart, which I will show you guys now because I think this was the last thing from Amazon. So you can see this is the largest size that this hurricane comes in from Walmart and um, it fits perfectly with like the two packs of tulips from Amazon. So both of these hurricanes were in my Walmart video that I shared last week. Um, I believe this is the medium and this is the large. I'll confirm that and put the sizes in the description bar below, but I love these. They do look like when I bought them in stores, obviously they're just really dusty. Um, these are dishwasher safe. So I just threw these in the dishwasher or you can just do like Windex on them, but these are very, very nice quality. And just to compare, so this is a Target hurricane. They still have these. I literally saw them today in the large size. These have a lip around the top, so you can kind of see the difference. This one I think is also just a little bit more squared off. I actually prefer this one, and I think they are similar in price, but I do believe that this one was cheaper. Um, this one is just like a thicker, more heavy duty glass. So to each its own, but they do have different like looks to them. Again, just like the lip on the top here. Uh, but Target has these in stock like today. And I actually got this before my son was born and I got this blue candle and then ended up deciding not to burn it. So it just kind of sat in there and I got a like fall candle today. That's like a light brown color that I might do the same thing, but we'll just we'll kind of have to see. Well, let me go through the Target stuff because there is so much of it. Like it's, it's crazy. Yeah. So first today I did get a bright orange knit throw. <laughs> My son is being so loud today. It's the cutest thing. So I did get this bright orange knit throw because I wanted something that was like a really bright, vibrant color. I do have some pillow covers that I will use, uh, but I wanted something that was just really bright and orange. We have gray sofas. And so I cut this knit throw and I absolutely love it. And it is super, super soft. And they had it in a lot of colors, at least at my target. This was more towards the like hearth and home. Um, I think that's, is it hearth and home or hearth and hand? 
section. Um, it was with that kind of home decor and not with the regular blankets. And again, I will have this stuff linked below for you guys, but if you do want to shop at your regular Target, you know, I'll, I'm telling you where it's from just so you know where to look. This was actually, our Target has it in the back right hand corner where they like, it's very seasonal stuff. So they had like school supplies there just a couple weeks ago. Today they were putting out all of their Halloween stuff. And I actually ended up getting this really pretty wreath from that section. It was $20. Um, it's just orange, white, and black. And I wanted to get something that was like small and thin. Cause I don't love to have a super thick wreath on our front door because I can't see out. So I did want to get something, but I got something that was a little bit thinner, which I really like. Chunky. Do you guys want to see chunky today? You get so thick. Look. He's pushing it 20 pounds. Thick. He is wearing sailboats because his daddy dressed him this morning. And no pants because I pulled them off. They did not fit him. We have to, we need to order more three to six months short or no six to nine month shorts because his three to six do not fit him anymore him and six to nine oh. all right more target stuff dollar section you guys these were or i think they were five but you know like the little dollar spot when you walk in um i actually ordered some candy to put in these because i think that would be a really cute way to like you can put cotton balls in these you can put you know anything you really want but i thought this would be really cute to put like some candy in this one and i might put this one in the bathroom um you could also put like there's battery powered string lights that would be really cute in these but just do know these have a lid to them so be very careful with them also in the dollar section i got two sets of dish towels so this one says you are the pumpkin to my spice and it's white with orange writing and then the back has um orange pumpkins on it and then i got this one it says autumn leaves and pumpkin please and then on the back it's got like a little more fall stuff i just like little hand towels like this to just you know hang from our um dishwasher and our stove and i needed some new ones this year because ours from last year are just not the cutest i also need to get new christmas ones when that comes out and then this was also in the target dollar spot it was five dollars and it says for use with one tea light candle only to prevent fire but i loved the little leather strap around it um i got that i, I don't know if i have a candle that fits in that currently um but i think i might so if you love this hurricane idea here with the um, candle on the inside, it's the threshold candles I got. This is the six inch by three. And like I said, I just like put this down in here and I never really lit it, but you could easily, you could easily do something like this. Just, you know, be careful and be aware that when you light it, it is going to melt to the bottom of this um, and cut off the plastic first. <laughs> this is such a casual video compared to some of my other ones that I do with my son grunting in the background. These pumpkins were all over by the hearth and hand section as well, like in that back corner decor section. I got some different sizes and a couple different colors because I thought they would be really cool um, on the like dinner table, but they are glass, so not recommended for outdoor use, uh, but I love the colors of them. And they range from like five to $15, depending on the size that you got. So last year we got mums and pumpkins for our front porch and I loved it, but the only thing is the pumpkins, of course, just attract more bugs. So, and I liked the white pumpkin look. Um, so what I'm gonna probably do this year is get white faux, or I got the white faux pumpkins and I'm probably only gonna get smaller orange pumpkins. Uh, I just find that those didn't attract as many bugs as like the big ones. And then I will kind of like strategically put these by our door with our mums, but we haven't picked up our mums yet. Um, so they have these back in the back corner at Target, like with the Halloween stuff. So it's a really pretty white pumpkin. They had orange ones, they had some like taller ones, but these are, outdoor they are a little bit more expensive i think like 20 this one's 20 dollars, but they had a couple different sizes so again this is like for outdoor use a little bit more durable and i did get two of these yeah we got two i think last year when we got pumpkins it was like the same weekend we announced our pregnancy with Ezra. yeah and then for faux plants so i got this gorgeous gorgeous it is the goldenrod arrangement it's threshold 20 bucks, not gonna come out, which I really like. Again, I have to be careful with my animals. I thought this would be really cute by my bedside table. Um, so I love the really bright, like it's coming off a little bit more green on camera. It's this really pretty like mustard yellow and I love it. But this is the thing that got me. Target had 
so many big vases and so much like pompous grass but the problem was the pompous grass didn't fit in this vase and i really wanted this one and not like the orange one hobby lobby had pompous grass but again it's all so tall and hobby lobby's was way more expensive like a stem of pompous grass at hobby lobby is 20 dollars um, they were doing the 50% off this week on all of their like faux florals. So even then it was still $10 a stem. These stems were $6 a piece. So I got three of, so it's hearth in hand. I got three of the like faux eucalyptus and then I have it in this ooh, white $30 hearth in hand as well. Such good quality and I will cut the tags off and then let it sit in there like that. Find a place for this in my home. Okay. This was very casual, kind of all over the place, um, but we just got home like within the last 20 minutes and I wanted to really share it with you guys before I like wash it, pull all the tags off of it and start strategically putting it around my home. But that's what I'm gonna spend today doing is getting all of my like summery stuff up. I'm really ready for fall this year. Um, I love decorating for the fall time and then like of course for Christmas. So thank you guys so much for watching. Love y'all so much and I will see you in my next video.